I'm Ramana. I'm representing a company called Code Tantra. Code Tantra is one of those startups based out of Hyderabad, which has created the world's first interactive learning platform. Now, this platform is completely different when compared to online learning system that we have. Okay? And uh, the way it is different is, normally online learning or e-learning platforms tend to use videos to teach. However, when we want to teach or when a student wants to learn programming, they have to type on a computer and learn. So what we have created is, we have created this online platform where user gets to actually type and learn the code. Okay? The greatest challenge while he types, on, types and learns is when he's stuck with a runtime error. Okay? So what we have done is, we have developed an intelligent runtime error analysis engine that helps him overcome his own error and complete the assignment. So this way we have students, the learners, who are from schools, colleges and universities who are able to learn programming uh, on their own completely. You know, the challenge that we throw up is that anyone can start learning to code within 60 minutes. Now currently the different courses that we have are, we have Java, we have uh, Selenium Automated Testing, we are in fact the world's first and only platform where someone can learn Selenium Automated Testing online without seeing videos by writing code. Okay. Similarly we have developed for Hadoop and Big Data, we also have C programming language which is widely used in, uh, uh, which is widely taught in uh, colleges and universities. Our target audience are uh, mostly the young entrepreneurs or learners who want to write code and start their own startup companies and also students who are uh, in the engineering colleges and universities who are studying who want to uh, you know uh, learn programming on their own we are planning to come out with python with our programming language and we know the upcoming like angular js and all the latest technologies which are used by the industry and uh, today our immediate target is to see how wide we can expand the base the uh, i mean we are talking about the penetration here. So we are trying to see how we can go into maximum number of colleges and universities spread across India. We want to see that uh, students, even from the most rural villages, right, they also can have the same quality IT education, okay, that uh, those who are in the best of the universities like IITs or BITs have. Yeah, we do. For example, I'll take you, uh, we have this uh, farmer's son who came down from Pulivandala, okay, and uh, the father of this son, he actually called us and said, uh, uh, would you offer Java training? Okay, I would like my son who is studying in 8th class to learn Java. Then uh, we said, why not? But the only condition is we don't teach. He has to sit on the computer and learn. And we have this software which will guide him, which will make sure he learns programming. So he was game for it. Then he tried it out, he liked it and he started, he completed the course. After completion of the course, the father had a confession to make. He called up and said, great, my son actually completed Java course, but I have a confession to make, I lied to you. He said, what, what, what was the case? Then, you know, what he said was that if I say my son was in seventh class, there was no training institute here who was ready to accept my son to teach Java. Okay, so I mean, that all the more proved our own platform saying, look, a, a student from even seventh class can also start writing code on their own. See, for being uh, a startup company, it's very important that we get right exposure. And Startup is one of those events where you have uh, young entrepreneurs, students from various colleges in and around Vijayawada coming up, right? So this actually gave us a good exposure here in this region.